Hello everyone, welcome to Pandey Guruji YouTube channel. Uh, in this video, uh, I will discuss very important interview question, uh, which is the uh, basically one of my student who uh, taking my classes. Uh, he attend the interview, and this this is very interesting question uh, got on one of the MNC organization. So the question is uh, uh, basically based on the execution plan, that is the performance tuning. And this question is related to the performance tuning. So the question is, what is edge in the SQL Server uh, execution plan? So we'll discuss in the detail, uh, basically uh, what we have the edge in the execution plan. So let's jump to the uh, SSMS. So first you can open the uh, SSMS. So uh, I'm just go, uh, giving you on overview that is the uh, what the execution plan is there. So when we run any of the query, uh, any of the code, so if you execute like uh, any select statement, uh, uh, any uh, update statement or any delete statement, in the backend, SQL engine will uh, generate uh, one of the execution plan, uh, like the uh, how the uh, the query will be performed, how the operation is the perform. So uh, to enable the execution plan, uh, we have the option. Uh, you can uh, uh, you can see here we have uh, one of the option is the uh, in, uh, include actual execution plan, and uh, we have the uh, estimated execution plan. Okay, so basically uh, two type of the execution plan is there. So one is the actual execution plan. So actual execution plan you can see the option uh, this option is the include actual execution plan or the second one is the estimated execution plan so before running the query if you click this one this will be give the estimated execution plan so this execution plan you can see uh, pictorial representation like uh, uh, how the uh, code will be uh, so this will be generate before the running of the code so might be the uh, execution cost will be increased or decreased. Uh, this is the estimated one. So you can see arrow will be there. This is the cluster index applied. So if you put the uh, mouse here, you will get some type of the what physical operation is performing, uh, what logical operation is performing. Uh, but if you want to in, in enable the actual execution plan, just you can select this one and uh, you can run the code. So uh, you can see two uh, one is result and one is the message so uh, before running you need to be enable this one and then you need to be run this okay so once you in enable the actual execution plan you can see one new window will be uh, pop up that is the execution plan where all we have the uh, information but uh, our question is uh, uh, basically what is the edge in the sql server uh, uh, execution plan so this is the nothing but uh, when we have this type of the arrow so just you can click on the arrow and you can just click on the properties so in right side you can see uh, edge is coming e d g e and this we have all the detail like uh, this is the uh, 60000 record uh, how much uh, data will be uh, occupied how much space is the occupied so you can see 13 mb will be there and estimated row size uh, will be 220 uh, byte uh, actual number of the row will be 60398 uh, so in this uh, edge uh, option you can find the uh, more detail about the uh, what operation performed so this is the all about uh, uh, in the execution plan so why we use the edge because uh, uh, sometimes when we have created the uh, table or the created uh, data is uh, loading uh, we have some limitation uh, that uh, this size will be limited for the table or uh, you can uh, also see how much uh, space is occupied uh, for this uh, uh, record whatever you are uh, selecting or you going to insert into the any of the uh, application database so uh, this is the very real time use cases that is the reason uh, you got this type of the question in the interview uh, so we'll continue discuss about the uh, performance and tuning or other uh, question related uh, interview 
questions so if you want to join one to one training with me uh, you can uh, connect the number which is given in the video description so uh, thank you so much for the watching this video i uh, will meet again in next video thank you